The Ancient Eight meets again, and this time in Princeton, New Jersey. At night one of the Ivy League Swimming and Diving Championships, it was all Princeton in its home pool. The Tigers set a new school record in the 200-yard medley relay, highlighted by a strong back half of the race from veteran Nikki Venema and newcomer Sabrina Johnston, who went sub-22 seconds to anchor the race. Winning some big relay points for your team here, the first race of the meet, does that bring some momentum in for you guys? Uh, yeah, definitely. Um, we wanted to start the meet off right, and it's just really exciting because we got another relay under our belt, and we're just going to keep going and having fun, and we thank all the fans for coming here tonight, and it's been a really awesome time, so we hope to keep it going. And then finally, Sabrina, 21-9. Is that your first time under 22? How's the taper feeling? Yes, it's my first time under 22, and it feels great. Um, wearing a new suit and just, like, having this sort of energy around us is just amazing, and I had so much fun with it. <laughs> Venema was back in the pool to lead off the 800 freestyle relay, which also broke the Denunzio pool record. That was much in thanks to the anchor, Ellie Marquardt, the longtime distance freestyle force in the Ivy League. Seeing that your team won the first relay, was that motivating coming in the race? I would say definitely yes. Uh, as a freshman, it was just so electric, surrounded by people who just swam so amazing and such a great team. And Nikki, you and Sabrina both had an incredible back-to-back. -back. I mean, not a lot of time to warm down. How did you prepare and then throw down a 144.7? Oh, oh. <laughs> um, yeah, it is a tough turnaround, but it's why we swim. It's fun. It's difficult. Um, and I was just really excited to swim with these ladies. I mean, it's the best team around, and I just love them so much. So I'll do anything for them. And then finally, Ellie wrapping it up, diving it in at the same time as a Harvard swimmer. What was your strategy going into that final 200? Back halfing. I was so excited. I wanted to chase her down. Didn't really have that chance, but I just wanted to go as fast as I could on the second 100.